Hey guys, welcome back to Subnautica. Um, I think at this point we're just at the exploring stage. Like, there's not a whole lot more I can do. I'm just getting out and about. Um, let's just double check. I've been told. Oh, I've been told a couple. I still need to scan this. It won't let me scan it. Oh wait, orange, not purple. Welcome oh my goodness. Captain. I'm an angel. Holy crap the way I flew. My goodness. Screw that one up. Yeah, I can't do it. I don't know how it jumps so high. We can only drop stuff from the water. Well, that's unfortunate. I screwed that one up. Okay. Put that in there. Put that in there. I was told that there is absolutely no reason for me to haul this freaking mask around. So, I'm gonna be done with it. <laughs> um, but beyond that, we got some snacks. I got a couple more, let's just top off our food. Or not our food, our water. Ah, oh, come on, it's almost there. Ah! <laughs> I can do it. Yeah! Okay. Now... I guess we'll bring an extra one of these. I don't know if I'll actually be out that long, but we'll see. It, it only takes up one space. I totally thought it took more than that, so... That makes it even better just to take it. Um, yeah. I don't know where we're gonna go, but we're gonna go somewhere. Welcome aboard, Captain. All um, systems online. You know what I can do, actually? There was something I forgot to check. Um, so if we can go out to the, the Gossy Habitat. There's something I want to check. Oh, also, something else I was told was good. Digital life forms, fauna, carnivores. Crab squid? Yeah. This large predator can be found in deep waters where it lurks a among the blood kelp the mem and membrane trees in search of prey, it can deploy a powerful electrical magnetic pulse to defend itself. Limbs. Ten limbs feature different appendages for swimming, walking, hunting, and possibly even tool use. Creatures caught in its grasps are expertly butchered and quickly consumed. Behavior. Rays and other illuminated herbivores are its usual prey, and its approach and attack any light source in the light source. That is good to know. <laughs> and they just seen its EMP blast was likely developed as a response to predation by creatures with electrical hunting mechanisms. Intelligence. While crab squids appear to have large brains and a resemblance to the intelligent squids on Earth, the organ inside the creature's head is in fact its stomach, which it must fill with startling regularity. Assessment neutralizes electrical equipment. Lights attracts its unwanted attention. You gotta be kidding me. So that entire time I was having a pain with it. I just need to turn off my lights. Did I just see something? Oh, that's the one I've already been through. Okay, alright, we get it. It's dark. It's real dark down here. I 
I don't realize how deep this is. Land. How far? I haven't really traveled deep down far, have I? Oh, it's just better. Ooh. No, no, no. No, thank you. Been a while since I've played. Yeah, so let's keep our lights off now. Yeah, now he's just chilling. He's just a chill homeboy. Alright, so what I'm doing is. Is he coming after me? No. Huh! Um, in the like, mess comments, message thing, in one of the audio logs, it said that he went down. So I was just curious. I think I need creature ink. I was just curious if, uh, there was like something down here that I could find. That's not friendly. Okay, well, no, there's not really anything. So we'll just go ahead and continue on exploring, I guess. It, this is some. Is there nothing else down here besides this one little cave? Like, is, it, is this entire thing just... No, oh, oh no, that's something to do. Let's see, river. Oh, not river, just water. Ooh. This is new. I'm just curious if it's also scary. <laughs> I think these are guys are okay. I think they're nice. But there's nowhere to go? Question mark. Ah! Okay. Yeah, it is. Wait. Am I being dumb? I'm being dumb. Don't mind me. Oh, I think. Can I scan this? I think so. Ooh, ooh, I did not know that was a thing. Okay. Fun fact that stuff hurts. <laughs> oh, I can get close to it right here. Okay. Can you scan? Scan? Nor do I have any idea how to get out of here if I wanted to. So, that's fun. Oh, oh. Oh, look, I have a message. <sighs> Terrain scans indicate this biome contains unusually high concentrations of organic and fossilized remains. Please, no, 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 see me. Please, no. I do not prefer to be seen at this current moment. I did not take the time to make the, uh, um, whatever it's called, the thing that makes, makes them go away. The, that scares him off. My man is just hanging around right by the entrance. Oof. 
I'm kind of spooked. Can I, there was another way I could go back here. I wonder if I can go that way. Because he is just right there. And it's really freaking annoying, honestly. I do not appreciate. Oh. I almost missed this. No, stop it. My eyes are off. Is he still coming? Is he coming for me? Or is he just... Or is he just... chilling? I mean, scoot, scoot around. I just... Oh, that's a Hey, baby. Nickel. I forgot to scan it. <laughs> Nickel. And interesting part is I didn't learn how to make anything from that. You know? Like I thought. Pick it up and then... Scan. Ooh! Ancient skeleton. Where to? Alien scent. Oh, I just thought it was a light. It's a sensor? Research probes. That's cool. making all these noises, but it's extremely unnecessary. Y'all need to chill. I have that. I have an orange tablet. I have one. Somewhere. some stuff in here. Where is the squid at? He's not gonna borrow sea moth, is he? Better not. I'll be peeled. Thank you for making the sound twice. I appreciate that. <laughs> Emilio, um, Oh my goodness, Amoy Boyd, Amoy Boyd. Alien flora specimen. Alien research equipment. <gasps> I got to, I got to see me. Okay. I need to get out of here soon. We're kind of... Air is whittling away. That's some cool. Cool stuff. going this way. Let's go see what's... What? The fetch? Who are you? Okay, well, now we know that we have to go through old buddy over here. Old Texas Ranger. 
garden this you can really have a garden this entrance. Oh left. Oh he's over there. Okay, we're just gonna we're gonna book it. Is there any more big guys? He that he looks mean, but not as mean as wherever the heck he is. Oh no, I lost him. Oh no, I lost him. I don't know whether to be happy or extremely afraid. You know? Like, yay, he's gone. Where'd he go? This is kind of cool. What's that? Um, nothing I can get next to. You. Okay. Anything unique come out of here? Nope, just a little laid. Lithium. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave Seamoth over there because he's he's safe. I think. Ooh, ooh. Oh that that okay. Can I scan this one? Nope. I thought like Oh, that's where I know it from. Okay. Oh, look at this cute fishy. It's a flower. Or a fly. One of the two. Oh, that, he looks less cute. What? In the... Oh, Judas. I didn't realize he was so close. That's nice. What is this? Oh, man. Okay. Oh. Is there really nothing exciting here? I thought I'd find... Like, I was exploring out just because I thought I'd find something i need, you know? It's like a whole... It's a new area. There'll be something cool. But no. See all the way back there. Was that? Where is progress? I know I saw progress. I just can't remember where. Oh, it's over there. Okay. That looks like something that keeps on. Oh, there's more skele more skeletons. Hopefully not more big, big fishies. Oh, sorry. I came with the new domain. My bad. Six percent damage. We're not doing too bad. Okay. Can I scan this one? I don't think so. I don't see any reason I won't be able to. I can scan one of them. The big head one. Okay. 
This is a big area. This seems like an area where a big fishy lives. Like, part of me would love to be wrong, but also another part of me would love to, to find one so that I know what to be afraid of. Oh! What? Why, why is it like this? Oh, it's getting hot. Okay. Keep going deeper. Why not? Carnivores. What have we scanned that seems like it could be worth something? Like, oh, that's. The skeleton is a million years old. Armored carnivore. For Projections suggest this life form could have been larger than any living creature encountered on the planet. The oceans at the time would have been very different to support life forms of this size, with more open geography and more individuals than the Leviathan range. Makes Leviathan fossils. These fossils likely came from ancient ancestors to the Leviathan, which inhabit the planet today. The relative size and delicacy of the bones suggest they perform formed part of the ear canal and some more complex. Internal structure. I know, I'm not sure if I understand what's going for there. Sea dragon skeleton. The semi intact skeletal structure of Leviathan class predator. Head trauma. This is clear evidence of massive physical trauma to the head. The damage is so severe, it's likely. Like what? What? Back the freak off. No one loves you. Oh. Where is the head trauma? Ah. All right, I'm leaving this place. Any big fishies here, please? Please, not, not pleases and yeses and pleases and no. I really love the uh, to be. I need, I need to relax. I'm kind of stressed out of my mind actually. That attack right there. Okay. Age. Something in the environment has helped to preserve these remains, but calcium decay suggests approximate time of death 1,000 years ago. Growth suggests the creature was in an egg laying stage of its life cycle. Yeah, so this is what I needed. Just some calm, some good music. Ghost ray. Go. Yeah, ghost ray. Come on. There you go. Giant cove tree. Covered, only one of its kind can on this planet. Bark. It's a ghost leviathan. The tree appears to be ancient nesting ground. The eggs were laid when the tree was young, and now the branches protect and grow with them as they wait for the right conditions to hatch. Well, that's wonderful. Those are ghost leviathan eggs. What? Why am I red? Was just the lighting? So it wasn't taking damage. Also, my water's gone down a lot. Where 
Let me see what. Hopefully, it doesn't go down too much more, otherwise, we'll have to start. Leave. That's kind of sad. Welcome aboard, Captain. Start cranking, I guess. Maybe this is onward. So now we know when I come back here, bring the energy, or like the heat production thing, jig, or energy efficiency, one of them, and the, the, the scary thing, the scary way that the scary monsters. Warning. Maximum damage oh. reached. Oh. Pile damage imminent. I kind of forgot that was a thing. <laughs> Interesting. How, how deep does this go? It's nothing exciting. Is there anything? Here that I need to collect. I still don't know how to make. Ooh, ooh. What is. What is. I'm still taking damage. Why? I. Okay, it's directional, not depth-wise. So anything that way is, is heat. There is the reinforcement thing that I can get. So I have to go back and get that, I guess. This is such a long wait. Is this gonna hurt me? Oh no, it's nice. Good. Make it when it's nice. But it's, I guess it's good that we go back because then you go and uh, get some more water. I'm kind of running out already. Um, I just I get a little more situated to come down here. Okay. What I do. So, one of my concerns up, or like questions been up to this point, is the reason I don't have air, aerogel is because I haven't gotten deep enough. But obviously, at this point, I've gotten as deep as I physically can. So. There is something else going on here. I don't. I just don't know where to find it. Which is quite unfortunate. So I will go do a little more not surface exploring, but like not cave exploring like I'm doing currently. How my inventory wise? Not too bad. Warning. Maximum depth reached. Pile Sorry. damage imminent. The fact that I got all the way over here without once hitting crushing death, like I don't want way past this. I never once went deep enough to realize that that's how deep I was. Good on me, I guess. Uh, the lines on the side are really there. No need to be that intense, my goodness. Okay, I'm pretty sure there was nothing here. It was just it's in the next area. However, I haven't been this way. Where's my power? 58%? All these scans is probably giving it hits. 
but also, at least I'm alive. Ooh, the spider singies. What is this area? Creepy. Oh, there's a ghost Leviathan over there. And it seems to me like the game wants to for like forces you to go through a ghost Leviathan just to get into the Oh, oh, hi. You could have told me you were coming closer. I would have appreciated the warning. Please don't stop. Stay with you. Guard the entrance and exit, don't they? I'm guessing this is an exit, you know? I don't even know. I could get back get behind them just to find out it's a dead end. Okay, since he's over there, I think we can get through over here. I don't know where he went. Somewhere over there. We're just gonna crank it. Pedal to the metal. Hope we make it. Which we will. Local scans show a nearby opening, leading to a biome with extensive fossilized remains. Okay. I think... We already got one of these, right? So, we'll take one just in case. What is that sound? Excuse me. What is a big scary noise? Extremely unnecessary. Oh, it's just the freaking music. Why is it so intense? Stop it. Chill out. You're giving me anxiety. Okay. Well, this anxiety and tech for y'all is gonna have to wait. It's time to end the episode. But I'm dying a little bit. Anyways, well, that was an eventful episode. Um, yeah, I'm just, I'm just heading back to base at this point. Well, kind of. Yeah, I'm heading back to base, kind of checking out everything I've got, and then going back out exploring again. Yeah, on that note, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!